The west coast of Scotland is rich with Lynx golf, including the Open Championship venues of Prestwick, Royal Troon and Turnbury. But this is the story of the newest kid in the block, the wonderful Dundonald Lynx. The course was first laid out in 1911 by Willie Fernie, measuring 6,700 yards. It was thought to be the longest course in the world at the time. Originally known as Southern Gales, the course was turned over to the military during World War II and lay dormant until it was acquired by Loch Lomond Golf Club in 2003. The American golf architect, Carl Phillips, was brought in to create a modern Lynx masterpiece in which he tried to utilise the strongest and most interesting of the natural features and then create grander, more dramatic landforms over the remainder of the site. Unlike many traditional Lynx courses, where you can see the other players on a parallel or distant fairways, Dundonald tucks those golfers away behind high dunes and deep hollows so that you continually feel you have the course to yourself. The signature hole is without doubt the short par 3 11th, measuring just 120 yards. It's Dundonald's version of Royal Trim's postage stamp. The green lies across ways with three rather intimidating pot bunkers guarding its approach. The infamous Cauldron Bunker lurks cunningly at the back of the green, waiting to catch those who overclub. In 2019, Dundonald was bought over by Darwin Escapes, who then embarked on a £25 million development, including a new clubhouse, accommodation in the forms of lodges and hotel rooms, truly making this a world-class golf experience for the visiting golfer. The Lynx has played host to many great championships over the years, including the Women's Scottish Open, and then, in 2017, the Men's Scottish Open. It was won that year in a playoff by Rafa Cabrera Bello, whose three wood from 275 yards over the burn on the 18th hole finished just six feet away, securing his third European title. The Donald Lynx has quickly become a must play with golfers from all over the world and it's not difficult to see why. <laughs>